Welcome back. Get ready to dive into the world of tech with MA Tech. Bringing you the latest updates, reviews, and insights in just a few seconds. The upcoming iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max are set to include Wi-Fi 7 support, marking a significant upgrade in wireless technology for Apple's flagship devices. This new standard is designed to operate across multiple frequency bands, 2.4 GHz, 5 GHz, and 6 GHz, all at once. This capability enables the devices to handle more data streams simultaneously, which directly translates into faster data transfer rates. The inclusion of Wi-Fi 7 in the iPhone 16 Pro models is expected to deliver noticeable improvements in performance. Users can anticipate not only faster download and upload speeds but also reduced latency, which is particularly beneficial for online gaming, video calls, and streaming high-definition content. The more stable and reliable connectivity ensures that users experience fewer interruptions and smoother transitions between networks. For everyday users, this enhancement means more seamless multitasking, even in environments with multiple devices connected to the same network. Whether at home, in the office, or on public Wi-Fi, the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max are poised to offer a superior experience with less interference and better overall network efficiency. Apple's early adoption of Wi-Fi 7 not only sets a new standard for mobile devices but also indicates the direction of future connectivity trends. As more devices become Wi-Fi 7 compatible, users of the iPhone 16 Pro series will be well positioned to take full advantage of next-generation wireless networks, ensuring their devices remain at the cutting edge of technology for years to come. Wi-Fi 7 is set to revolutionize wireless connectivity on the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max, offering peak theoretical speeds exceeding 40 gigabits per second. This represents a fourfold increase over the maximum speeds of Wi-Fi 6E, which is currently supported by the iPhone 15 Pro models. This leap in speed will allow for lightning-fast downloads, smoother streaming of ultra-high-definition content, and seamless online gaming experiences without any lag. Supply chain analyst Jeff Pu had previously predicted that Wi-Fi 7 support would be integrated into the iPhone 16 Pro models, and this has now been confirmed. Pu's insights often reflect accurate supply chain information, giving credibility to the expectation that these iPhones will be among the first to embrace this next-generation technology. The inclusion of Wi-Fi 7 is a clear indicator that Apple is focusing on future-proofing its flagship devices, ensuring they remain at the forefront of wireless technology advancements. The iPhone 16 Pro models are anticipated to be released in September, continuing Apple's tradition of fall launches. With the new iPhones adopting Wi-Fi 7, Apple's lineup will now span across three generations of Wi-Fi standards. While the iPhone 11 through iPhone 14 models are compatible with Wi-Fi 6, the iPhone 15 Pro series already supports Wi-Fi 6E. This gradual progression highlights Apple's commitment to providing cutting-edge wireless capabilities with each new generation. The integration of Wi-Fi 7 not only enhances speed but also ensures that the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max are well prepared for the evolving landscape of wireless networks. As Wi-Fi 7 becomes more widespread, users of these new iPhones will be able to fully capitalize on its benefits, from faster data transfer to more reliable connections in crowded environments. This makes the iPhone 16 Pro series a compelling choice for those looking to stay ahead in the tech game. Rumors surrounding the iPhone 16 Pro have hinted at a significant change in Apple's color palette. Apple is reportedly planning to phase out the blue titanium option, which was a distinctive feature of the iPhone 15 Pro models. Instead, the company is likely to introduce a new color variant, with early speculation suggesting a rose or gold hue. However, the latest insights indicate that the new color might actually be bronze or have a bronze-like appearance. The potential switch from blue titanium to bronze reflects Apple's ongoing effort to keep its flagship devices visually fresh and appealing. The bronze finish is expected to offer a premium and sophisticated look, catering to users who favor a more classic and luxurious aesthetic. This color change could also resonate well with those who appreciate the uniqueness and warmth of bronze tones, setting the iPhone 16 Pro apart from its predecessors. Introducing a new bronze finish could be a strategic move by Apple to redefine the identity of the iPhone 16 Pro series. 
Colors play a crucial role in how consumers perceive and differentiate between iPhone generations. By moving away from blue titanium, which was well-received but perhaps too similar to previous shades, Apple might be aiming to create a distinct visual identity for the iPhone 16 Pro models, making them instantly recognizable and desirable. Recent leaks from the Weibo-based source, Fixed Focus Digital, have shed light on a new color option for the iPhone 16 Pro Max that is generating buzz, described as a bronze hue. This color is expected to offer a unique and refined look that sets it apart from previous color offerings in Apple's lineup. Unlike the more subdued tones of past iPhone models, this bronze shade is anticipated to bring a fresh and sophisticated appeal to the iPhone 16 Pro Max. Complementing the new bronze hue, the surrounding frame of the iPhone 16 Pro Max is rumored to have a titanium-like appearance. This design choice is likely aimed at enhancing the overall premium feel of the device, providing not only aesthetic appeal but also increased durability. The titanium-like frame suggests that Apple is continuing its trend of using high-end materials to elevate the design and build quality of its Pro models. Earlier this month, Another Chinese leaker hinted that the color code for this new iPhone 16 Pro color is simply rose, not to be confused with the rose gold color introduced with the iPhone 6S back in 2015. This subtle distinction in naming points to Apple's intention to evolve its color palette, offering something that is both nostalgic yet distinctly modern. The new rose color is expected to be more understated and sophisticated compared to the original rose gold, aligning with current design trends. For iPhone enthusiasts and potential buyers, the introduction of these new color and material options offers an exciting glimpse into Apple's design evolution. The bronze hue paired with a titanium-like frame could appeal to users who are looking for a blend of luxury and modernity in their devices. As Apple continues to innovate not just with technology but also with aesthetics, the iPhone 16 Pro Max's new look might just be the standout feature that draws attention in an increasingly competitive smartphone market. Recent leaks have sparked interest in a new color option for the iPhone 16 Pro Max, described as a bronze hue by the Weibo-based leaker, Fixed Focus Digital. Interestingly, this color has also been referred to as rose by another source, raising the possibility that these claims might be describing the same color, just perceived differently under varying lighting conditions. This ambiguity adds to the alert, as the new hue could shift subtly offering a dynamic visual experience that changes with the environment. While the latest leak specifically mentions the iPhone 16 Pro Max, it is reasonable to expect that this new bronze-like color will also be available on the iPhone 16 Pro. Apple often maintains consistency across its Pro models in terms of color offerings, so it wouldn't be surprising to see this new shade extend to both devices. This ensures that users of either model can enjoy the fresh design direction Apple is taking with its latest release. In addition to the new bronze hue, the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max are expected to come in other classic colors, including black, white or silver, and a shade referred to as natural titanium. This palette reflects a blend of modern sophistication and timeless elegance, catering to a variety of tastes. The inclusion of a natural titanium option further emphasizes Apple's focus on premium materials and finishes, offering a rugged yet refined look that appeals to a wide audience. The introduction of this new color, whether perceived as bronze or rose, alongside classic tones, suggests that Apple is aiming to create a cohesive design language for the iPhone 16 Pro series. By offering a spectrum of colors that range from bold to understated, Apple is ensuring that users can choose a model that fits their personal style while enjoying the cutting-edge technology these devices offer. The consistency across the Pro models also reinforces Apple's commitment to delivering a premium experience, both in terms of aesthetics and functionality. Rumors are circulating that Apple plans to introduce a significant upgrade to the finish of the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max models. The company is expected to use an improved process for finishing and coloring titanium, resulting in a glossier look compared to the brushed aluminum finish seen on the iPhone 15 Pro models. This glossy titanium finish is anticipated to give the new iPhones a sleek, high-end appearance that resembles the stainless steel used in previous iPhone models. For those considering an upgrade, the introduction of a bronze finish could be a compelling reason to choose the iPhone 16 Pro. 
This new color option not only offers a fresh look but also aligns with the device's premium build and advanced features. As Apple continues to innovate both technically and aesthetically, the iPhone 16 Pro's bronze finish could become one of the most talked about design elements of this generation. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech content. See you next time on MA Tech.